How are stars born? Look up at the night sky and see the countless stars, each a distant sun. But where do these cosmic powerhouses come from? The birth of a star is a dramatic process that unfolds within vast clouds of gas and dust, a stellar genesis driven by gravity's relentless pull. Giant Molecular Clouds Let's talk about the stellar nurseries. Stars are born within enormous, cold, and dense clouds of gas and dust known as giant molecular clouds. These clouds can span hundreds of light years and contain enough material to form millions of stars. The conditions within these clouds are crucial for stellar birth. The force of gravity. Now let's introduce the driving force, gravity. Within these vast molecular clouds, denser regions can collapse under their own gravity. This collapse can be triggered by various events, such as shock waves from nearby supernova explosions or collisions between clouds. Heating up the core. It's time to imagine the collapse. As a dense region begins to contract, the material at the center starts to heat up due to the increasing pressure. This hot, dense core is called a protostar, a baby star still gathering mass from its surroundings. Spinning disks and jets. Let's consider the chaos of formation. As the protostar grows, the surrounding gas and dust form a spinning disk around it, much like water circling a drain. Material from this disk gradually falls onto the protostar, increasing its mass. Some of this material is also ejected outward in powerful jets along the protostar's rotational axis. As the protostar continues to accumulate mass, the temperature and pressure in its core eventually become so extreme, reaching millions of degrees Celsius, that nuclear fusion begins. Hydrogen atoms fuse together to form helium, releasing immense amounts of energy in the process. A star is born, and the outward pressure from this nuclear fusion balances the inward pull of gravity, creating a stable, shining star. Clearing the Cradle Let's talk about the final stages. The newborn star's powerful radiation and stellar winds eventually blow away the remaining gas and dust from its surroundings, clearing its birthplace and revealing the brilliant new star to the cosmos. So, stars are born from the gravitational collapse of dense regions within giant molecular clouds, a process that involves heating, spinning disks, powerful jets, and finally, the ignition of nuclear fusion in their cores. It's a cycle of cosmic creation that populates the universe with light and energy.